Welcome Sports Nation to Sports DTM, the sports channel where we call sports down the middle. You can expect the latest in sports news, views and reviews from our resident analysts. No sports topic is too controversial and no team or player is above criticism. So just smash that subscribe button and ring that notification bell to make sure you don't miss out on our balanced offering of riveting sports content. And don't forget to like, share and leave a comment below. Welcome to Sports DTM. Speaking with striker Kemar Roof. Kemar, you've been in the squad now for, for a little while now. How many how many games have you played? I've played three games now. Started to come on one. How are you feeling in the team now? How, are you are you getting more comfortable? Are you how, how are you feeling? You tell me from your own words. Yeah, I'm starting to get more comfortable. It's always difficult joining a new team, um, new players, new staff, new style of play. Um, so it's always difficult, but it's a bit more difficult international level than club level because club level, you can train with the, the team more. So to understand players and get to understand them quicker, but at international level, it's all about games. So you have no training sessions to actually get to know your teammates um, and their their style of play. So that's where it it's more challenging. All right. When you look around you, um, you see players of from, coming from different backgrounds, different countries they're playing and so forth. Um, are you uh, confident that this thing can be put together? I mean, we, we are struggling for points, but we do have Honduras tomorrow. Yeah, we're struggling for points. Um, and obviously, that's the only thing that people care about is the points where we where we land the table. Um, but I think we are showing signs of togetherness, especially in the last game against Canada. We're showing good signs. Um, it was unfortunate not to to win the game. Myself personally, I I come away from the game happy because of the way we performed, but also me disappointed personally because I thought um, I could have and should have scored. So I'm a bit disappointed in myself with that, but we showed good signs, uh, good, um, good together, good togetherness. But it's all like I said, it's also difficult because the team keeps changing. Um, there's, there's not a lot of consistency. We don't get to train often, just because of all the different rules like COVID. Some players can't travel for personal reasons. Some players can't travel um, because of injuries. So it, it's difficult for the management, the coaching staff to be able to get a group of players on a consistent basis and, and work with them. Uh, so you, we have, I say we have a game tomorrow. Um, what are the strong points that you see that we can could use probably against uh, on your team? I think we need to, as minim, the minimum is what we produced against uh, Canada, the togetherness, um, the, the running, the toughness, the aggression we showed. Um, and then we just need to add a bit of um, just extra, extra, extra quality in front of, in, in front of the goal to, to score more goals. So the only thing that was missing against Canada was we didn't score. I think if we scored against Canada and won the game, everyone would be saying that we had an excellent game. Um, and obviously we're just missing that main, ing main ingredient, which is, is the goal. And um, you were just coming into the squad. You came in fairly late compared to others. Um, are you how, how are you feeling with with the with the rest of the team? Yeah, no, I'm I'm settled in now. I'm I'm, I'm comfortable. I'm I'm happy. I'm here enjoying it. Um, obviously, we need more points. We need more wins, and, and and I'm confident that will come. It's just a matter of time. Just hope we don't run out of time. Thank you. No worries. Thank you.